Chapter 7 Finally I'm here. I've made it to Fukuoka Airport. As soon as I pass through customs I see Mami waiting. It has been four months since I saw her. She looks more Japanese than I remember. Her skin seems smoother. But Mami doesn't like my beard. She asks me, Did you put on weight? Outside, we catch a coach into the city. Tonight we'll stay at a businessman's hotel. We have a lot to talk about. Also, Mummy wants to cut my hair. For that she has brought an electric razor, scissors, a comb, and even a newspaper to spread on the floor. She's well prepared. We had met in New Zealand in April 1999. Mummy had come to New Zealand on a one-year working holiday visa. First she stayed in Auckland in the North Island. Then, after a month or two, she travelled to the South Island, to Dunedin. Mami wanted to live overseas as a resident, not just as a tourist. However, her English wasn't good enough, so she decided to improve it. One day she came to the language school where I worked. And the rest, as they say, is history. I showed Mami the sights of Dunedin. It's quite an attractive town. It has old stone buildings built with the profits from gold. During the weeks we talked, we walked, we shared food and became good friends. Being together soon felt more natural than being apart. We decided to do the deed. It wasn't long before we were living together and got married.